Senator Susan Collins says she will support Katanji Brown Jackson for the U.S. Supreme Court, becoming the first Republican to throw her support behind President Joe Biden's nominee. The senator from Maine said in a statement Wednesday that she reviewed Jackson's record, watched her testify during her Senate Judiciary Committee confirmation hearing last week, and met her twice in person, and concluded the judge possesses the, quote, experience, qualifications, and integrity to serve in the lifetime post. Collins' support further boosts Jackson's prospects of becoming the first black woman to serve on the top U.S. judicial body. In her statement, Senator Collins also lamented what she called a disturbing trend of politicizing the judicial nomination process. Quote, no matter where you fall on the ideological spectrum, anyone who has watched several of the last Supreme Court confirmation hearings would reach the conclusion that the process is broken. Looking at sexual images of children during Jackson's confirmation hearing last child week, child pornography, several Republicans repeatedly and dramatically accused her of being lenient in her previous role as a federal trial court judge in sentencing child pornography offenders. They were asked for. Senator, I've answered this question many times. Jackson defended her sentencing record, and American Bar Association witnesses of the hearing rejected the allegations that she was soft on crime. Democrats called the attacks unfair and undignified. With a simple majority needed for confirmation in the evenly divided Senate, Jackson will get the job if Democrats remain united, even without Collins' support. Democratic Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer said last week the chamber was on track to confirm Jackson before its expected break for Easter on April 8th. 